Welcome guys to a brand new video. In this video, I'm gonna talk about Samsung Galaxy A20s. So let's get started. Before starting, if you like watching smartphone and technology related videos, then consider subscribing to my channel and click that bell notification as well so you never miss any upcoming videos from me. So as you guys know, Samsung Galaxy A20 was launched this year, which was a budget phone and was having a pretty good specification in that price range. But now we have got to know that Samsung Galaxy A20s is also coming and instead of the dual camera, Camera setup, we're going to see a triple camera setup. Oh my god! Wow! But until now, we don't know how much megapixels of camera and what kind of camera we're going to get on Samsung Galaxy A20s. But I think the triple camera setup will consist of a main camera, then a wide angle, and the third and additional camera would be a depth sensor, which we didn't saw in Samsung Galaxy A20. So other than that, we have got a leaked picture of Samsung Galaxy A20s specification from which we get to know a lot about the device itself. But the main thing I noticed was that instead of the 4000 mAh battery like you saw on Samsung Galaxy A20, we are getting a 3000 mAh battery on Samsung Galaxy A20s. What? What the f It could be a wrong information as well, but if it is true, I'm having the same exact reaction. And if this information is true, I don't even see much of an upgrade from Samsung Galaxy A20 to Samsung Galaxy A20s. As you can see, we're getting the same Samsung Exynos 7884 chipset like we saw on Samsung Galaxy A20. The only upgrade I see in the specifications are that instead of the 3GB RAM, we're going to get a 4GB RAM and instead of the 32GB storage, we're going to get a 64GB storage, which in my opinion is okay. But making the battery 3000mAh instead of the 4000 image is really disappointing. Now it all depends on the price. If the price is low, then the specifications are okay and can be even good. But if the price is high, the specifications are not good enough. So comment down below what do you think about the 3000 mAh battery and will you buy it and if you would, how much money would you like to pay for this phone? So if you're new to this channel, I make videos on leaks and updates for upcoming smartphones. So consider subscribing and click that bell notification as well. Just do it! So thank you so much for watching guys. I hope you found this information helpful. If you did, leave a like and consider subscribing to my channel to see more videos like this one. And click that bell notification as well so you never miss any upcoming videos from me. So see you around in the next one.